In this video I will show you how you can work interactively on shared models using the model bus. In this scenario we have two developers, Susan and Peter, that are working with the UML modeling tool Papyrus MDT. Well, here you can see the UML model speed regulator and we have some diagrams for the model. Here we can see the use case diagram. Here we have the composite diagram. Here you can see a class diagram. And this is the state machine diagram for the class regulator. Well, first we want to share the project. We select model bus. And here we can enter the namespace for, for the project. Now we commit the project to the repository. And now Peter can check out the project from the repository to the workspace. Now Peter and Susan can start uh, working interactively on the shared model. We want to start with the class diagram. To avoid conflicts, uh, we can lock several elements. And in this case, we want to lock the package system. And you can see that both uh, developers can see that the elements are locked. Now we start and add a new enumeration to the class diagram. And we call it display color and we add a new enumeration literal and call it blue and a literal green. Now we can add a new class And we call it first display. And we add a property to the class and call it color, which has a type display color. And we add a realization from first display to display. Now we want to change the state machine diagram for the class regulator. So we add a new state. We add a new state. And call it off. And now we add a new transition from the state on to the state off. And another transition from the state error to off. Now Peter wants to change the use case diagram, therefore he locks the package use cases. And now Susan tries to add a new use case, but she is not allowed to do this. So Peter adds a new use case and call it update display. 
And you also add a new association from display to update display. Well, now he is finished and um, he can unlock the package use cases and Susan can also unlock the package system. Well, that's it and thank you for your interest.